So today we're going to be talking about waivers and release forms. These are crucial if you're doing anything commercial and even YouTube's getting to the point where you have to have these on a lot of the shoots that you're doing. We deal with a lot of dangerous stunts and we deal with commercial work where we have to have written permission by the athletes and the people that are in our videos. So Carter as a producer is the person that often deals with that while we're on set. So I'm going to have him talk about the logistics of that. First of all, I just want to say that we're going to have a link to download the waiver that we use, so you can see exactly what we do. That covers us, well, you know, we hope it covers us in court if anything were to happen, but pretty much things that the waiver does, how it protects you as a filmmaker is one, it says that anybody that's in your video, that they give you the right to use their image or their face or likeness, as it says, in your video. So then after that, you can post it on YouTube and they can't come and say, hey, you need to take this down. Um, the second thing that the waiver does is that it protects you in case anybody gets hurt. We do a lot of stunts for our videos and it's always a, a question of safety. We have a lot of people watching, taking part in the video, people we don't know. We ask our fans to come out. And the biggest thing is what would happen if they get hurt doing the slip and slide that we've set up for them. So we have them sign a waiver first saying that knowingly participate in the, in the stunt even though they know it could be dangerous and that they could get hurt and that they can't sue us for getting hurt in a video saying, hey, I did the slip and slide, I broke my arm and now you owe me $500 million because I'm sure that happens, right? Anyway, so the third thing is that in our waivers, in the case of our waivers, they say that even though you can't sue us, we do have to have production company insurance. You know, we at, when we're working with big brands, that's something that they, they do force you to have. So we have production company insurance that if anyone does get hurt, we can't, we, they are covered under our insurance. So they can't sue us, but we do try and take care of them. We don't want anybody to get hurt. Knock on wood, we haven't had any huge serious injuries. But so that's the waiver in a nutshell, and those are the, the three areas where it can protect you. We're gonna have that link in the bottom and we suggest that you go look at it, you can change it to however you want it to be. I know it might not make a lot of sense maybe as a young filmmaker starting out, but as things start to grow, uh, you, you never know, and it's good to start that practice, especially if you're putting footage on YouTube, and then people come by years later and say, hey, this is an awesome video you made, I wanna buy some of the footage and put it in a commercial. Do you have the releases for the people or the locations in it? That's the first question I get asked when people want stock footage is, hey, I see you have three actors. I need those release forms so that I can use you know, their, their image and their likeness. Most people don't know this, but we pay $37,000 US currency a year for insurance for the people on our shoots. So what that means is if we have a fan or someone else for that matter, an athlete, come on one of our shoots and they get hurt, we do have them sign a release form. They can't sue us, but we also have that insurance to take care of them in case something does go wrong because we do care about the people that are in our videos. You always have to be mindful of that and take care of them the best you can. So we have insurance to cover them if, if something goes wrong. We've only had to use that insurance, thankfully, a couple times, and it basically, they got hurt on the shoots, and we covered their medical bill, they went to the hospital and, and took care of all that stuff, and they're, they're still walking to this very day. So we have that insurance in case there is a freak accident. You never know if something's going to go wrong, and we do want to take care of our people. So even though we are covered legally through those waivers or release forms, we also also do everything we can to take care of the people that make our videos what they are. So a lot of people say, well, you're making money on these videos. But the truth is we spend it on these videos as well. And a lot of that has to do with taking care of the people that are actually in our videos. Now a good kind of example, Carter was just talking about this a moment ago, but a lot of times we'll have a big company come and say, hey, Devin, we love this video. We want to buy five seconds of it to use on national television. You also have to have the release form for this athlete though. So I sign off on it. I give them a, essentially a release form saying, I give you permission to use the footage from our company. And then after that, I have to get permission from the athletes. And we have them sign that release form. But whenever a big company comes in like that, we always try and give back. So we'll actually have them work out another deal, such as let's just say Dr. Pepper is kind of a example. 
we have them sign a paper release form as well, and then they get paid, we get paid, so everyone benefits together. So that's another way that kind of goes about, and that's why release forms are so important. But it's definitely within the film industry. So we'll have a release form down below that we use. We made it a little bit generic, so it would cover you in case you're wondering, like, what's a good release form that I can use. These are the ones that we use on our shoots. They're slightly altered for what we do, and our company is on that. But everything else, super generic so you can all use these release forms so you can get the best bang for your buck or so you can get the most out of your shoots and be protected and also take care of the people that are in your videos to make them happen. So that is our tutorial on release forms and waivers. Thanks so much for watching. Over and out.